November 12, 2021, brilliant evening star Venus is in the teapot this evening, passing cause Borealis. Saturn and Jupiter are visible to the upper left of Venus. Chart Caption, 2021, November 12, an hour after sunset, Venus, over 12 degrees up in the southwest, is to the lower left of cause Borealis, Lambda SGR. Saturn is to the upper left of Venus. By Jeffrey L. Hunt. Chicago, Illinois, Sunrise, 6.37 a.m. CDT, Sunset, 4.32 p.m. CDT. Check local sources for sunrise and sunset times for your location. Morning Sky. Mercury and Mars are low in the east-southeast before sunrise. Mercury is bright but only about 3 degrees above the horizon at 30 minutes before sunup. Mars is 2.0 degrees to the upper right of the speedy planet. Mercury is moving toward its superior conjunction, in the sun's bright glare, on November 28th. Mars is creeping into the morning sky, after its solar conjunction on October 7th. Evening Sky The planet pack, Venus, Saturn, and Jupiter, is in the southern sky after sunset. Venus is stepping through Sagittarius. The pattern more resembles a teapot than a centaur. This evening Venus passes 1.7 degrees to the lower left of Cos Borealis, Lambda SGR on the chart, the northern part of the bow of the archer. Find the planet over 12 degrees up in the southwest, one hour after sundown. Use a binocular to see the stars at this level of later twilight. In the teapot, Cos Borealis represents the star at the top of the lid of the pot. The star is reddish in color and it is less than 100 light years away. The star is thought to have a diameter that is over 10 times larger than our sun, shining with a brightness of over 50 suns. Saturn, stepping slowly eastward in Capricornus, is over 30 degrees to the upper left of Venus. Bright Jupiter is 15 degrees to the left of Saturn. The Jovian giant is moving eastward against the sidereal backdrop as well, in front of the stars of eastern Capricornus. This evening, the moon is nearly 16 degrees beyond, to the east of, Jupiter. Jupiter moves into the western edge of Aquarius on December 14th. Use a binocular to watch its slow eastward advancement compared to the distant, dimmer stars in the region.